We have some chest supported dumbbells row. Now what this means is simply we're just going to lay down and let the weight of the bench or the weight of your body be supported by the bench. We don't have to hold that with the core stability. Now although it's very, very important in most things we do, but this time we're just going to give your body a break a little bit. It's also going to help isolate that lat muscle. So we're going to do the chest supported row in this flat bench first. What that means is I'm going to straddle this bench, lay my chest on it, and relax my body. All we have to do from this point is retract that shoulder blade and row these dumbbells up. Now you notice what I'm doing with my hands is externally rotating them up just a little bit. What that does is help turn that lat on, keeping that shoulder pinned back, and row it to back where my belly button would be. I'm not rowing it up here, getting my trap or biceps, a little bit back towards my hips with a little bit of an external rotation. Now we're gonna do the same thing with the incline bench. Bring your dumbbells on over here, those dumbbells on the bench, set your feet, go ahead and rock your body onto that chest supported position. Now with the incline, my chin is above the bench, but I still have to retract those shoulder blades, externally rotate, and row those dumbbells to about where my belly button would be. Again, this is helping isolate the lat a lot more than if we were just going straight up.